there are times, as you can see here, that as baby moves, that baby will move in and out of that sample box. As in, we see the nose, the nose moves in and out of the sample box, so then we lose part of the image of the nose. That's a very normal thing. Here we see what appears to be like a little candy cane object going over the baby's bridge of the nose. That's the umbilical cord. Um, we're not getting that image very well because it's, because the umbilical cord is not in that sample box, so therefore, but here we do. Here we get a much better image because the umbilical cord is now within that sample box. We traditionally focus in on things that are recognizable, as in baby's cute little button nose, or different, you know, shoulders or feet come into play. And like there, there's an instance where we just saw where the baby's forehead um, went outside that sample box. And here, baby's out of the sample box quite a bit. So as we do this 4D image, it, it's a dance between capturing a living, breathing, beautiful baby and maintaining that image. Little profile from umbilical cord right there, right in front of those little lips. The baby's using the placenta like a little pillow. See that cute little bottom lip sticking out right there. Come on, baby. Let's see if we can get a better 